Hey, Paul Amandi, good working with you today, buddy. Um, I think we've got a good game plan. I'm excited. Um, I think it's important that you uh, you do find you know you find a good fit and uh, you commit to something for a long period of time. And like I said, with my meeting with Esteban at the very beginning before Q School, it's it's a matter of commitment. It's a matter of understanding that changes are going to feel funny and they're going to be different. But if we keep it simple. Uh, and we communicate a lot, then uh, we should be able to achieve the goal. So, anyway, here here we are looking at your putting. One of your your short term goal or your short game goals was to feel more confident over the putter uh, at all times. That's your those are your words. And one thing that I'd like to see is is uh, if you look at your center of pressure when you're putting, um, you can look over here on the left. You've got 47 percent of your weight on your lead foot, your left foot at the moment of impact or at uh, address, and you have 53% on your right. So some of the best putters in the world are going to be a little bit more stable and more anchored over the left side. So <clears throat> let's try to move that. So as you as you, you do a good job as you move the putter back, okay, you don't change that very much. And I like how you're anchored about 78%. You can see that over here um, in your in your lead heel. So that's good. As you come back and through, you don't move it much, but you can see your trace just a little bit, the little yellow underneath. There's a little bit of pressure moving around, which could cause the putter face to move, you know, and the, and the putter face is very important, obviously. So we want to make sure that we keep that nice and stable. So to just add that little bit of stability without making major stroke, you know, any stroke mechanic changes, um, take a look at the one on the right here. Now what we've done is, is we've changed it. So now you have 65% of your weight in your lead foot as opposed to 47 over here and you've you've maintained a lot of pressure in your le in your lead uh, heel here as well um, so you've got 65 and 65 this is a great position but watch as you as you stroke this putt as you start to move back on the right here the center of pressure dot doesn't move so you start at 65 moves a teeny bit as you prepare to take it back, 65, there you go, at impact 64, and through. So there's going to be a lot more stability with more pressure on the lead foot. So give that a try. Again, give me some feedback. Um, give me a call. Give me a text. Let me know how that's feeling in the next couple rounds of golf, and we'll go from there. All right, buddy. Good seeing you.